Hello guys and welcome to another YouTube video. I just made a feast, let me tell you. Tomorrow my dad is visiting me and my sister, she is coming over as well. And I prepared some food and it will be a surprise because they actually don't know that I prepared food, that we will have a feast. So I'm excited, I hope they are too. <laughs> and I made a raw vegan vegetable curry. This is so delicious, you guys. I have carrots and I actually um, made them a little bit softer in freezing them and thawing them. And then I have yellow bell peppers, red bell peppers, um, coriander, raisins, red onions, zucchini, um, dried apricots actually here. And the sauce is a special curry sauce. Yeah, it's it's really delicious with dried tomatoes, tomatoes, some you know different spices, ginger, cumin. Oh, the smell is so good. It it really it smells authentic, like like real cooked curry, like Thai curry. It's so good. And then I made mac and cheese as well. So if someone wants to have pasta instead of curry or both, they can indulge. <laughs> because this is fat free can you believe it it's a fat free mac and cheese sauce it's the best sauce i tell you and here i have more in case someone wants to have more sauce and this mac and cheese is my secret but yeah i will share it with my members private group so if you want to join feel free to do so and then i made rice cauliflower rice to serve with the curry. So we have rice with curry and mac and cheese and more mac and cheese sauce. And here I made a copper sauce. This is also cashew based copper and sauce. So really yummy. And this goes with the meatballs I have still in my dehydrator. Let me show you. Yeah, here. Um, let me see. Here are the meatballs. They are made from carrots, sunflower seeds, um, parsley, red onions, and I guess that's it. Yeah? Hmm? Not sure. A lemon? Maybe I put a little bit of lemon in there as well. And a bunch of spices like cumin and pepper and nutmeg. They smell really intense, like really like meatballs. <laughs> so good. And that's it for tomorrow's feast. I'm excited. Usually I don't eat like this. As you know, I like to have simple meals like bananas with lettuce or my simple salads with tomatoes and cucumbers and only choose for breakfast. But yeah, once in a while, and especially if someone is visiting and they are both not raw. So my dad is not raw, not even vegan. My sister is vegan, but not raw. And if <laughs> you want to impress someone who's not raw, you really have to dig a little bit deeper and find some really good, nice recipes that are similar to cooked food. And then everyone will love it. So that's my goal. I hope they will love it. <laughs> okay. That's it for this video, you guys. Just a little reminder, you can make everything raw. It's, it's possible and everyone will love it. And I wish you a nice day. See you in my next video. So much love and peace out. Bye, guys.